As the Olympics continue in Pyeongchang, one Milwaukee man is hoping his invention will be commonplace by the Winter Games in Beijing in 2022. Tom Durian live at the Pettit National Ice Center with the story of the hybrid clapskate. Yeah, that's what it's called, Charles and Shannon. As a kid, Brent Osprung practiced with members of the Team USA, and while he missed the Olympics, he hopes that his invention one day is going to make it up on that podium. As part of the U.S. speed skating team, Brett Osprung spent a lot of time on the Oval at the Pettit Center practicing for the 2010 Olympics in Vancouver, but an injury sidelined him from competitive speed skating for good, so he enrolled in engineering classes at UWM. And I'm sitting in my engineering class and we learned about this, this new mechanism. Brent took that mechanism and with the help of the university's student startup challenge, designed what he calls a hybrid clap skate. So it's going like this and every single time it's being picked up, the blade is indexing one time okay. and it gets through its entire index and it releases. In speed skating, there are fixed skates and clap skates, both with their advantages. Brent skate is both. Over the next several months, I had kind of developed that uh, a prototype and tested the prototype, and it ended up turning into a, a, a you know an idea that actually was going to work. Brent then applied for and got a patent. And while his Olympic hopes were sidelined, he hopes one day his skate will make it to the games. It would be great to just have a part of something of me to be at the Olympics. Yeah, and Brent is uh, currently looking for investors in his company, Dynamic Skate Technologies, or a possible partner to build that skate. Reporting live here at the Pettit Center, Tom Durain, today's TMJ4. Yeah.